Welcome home, Jin. Hey, Akos. I hear the Aegis awakened. Nasty shock for you? Or was it? Of course, my script showed how everything would play out from the start. Sure, you say that once it's all over and done with. It's easy to act smug when hindsight's on your side. Shut your mouth, Abrona. I'm shaking to my core. Where are the other two? Mikhail's inspecting the Ardanian factory. And my beloved sister is out hunting, as always. I'm sure she'll have found plenty of drivers to chew up and spit out by now. She likes to hunt, all right. Not sure we can use all of those core crystals, though. Do we know where the Aegis is right now? Have no fear, Jin. Of course we know her whereabouts. Abrona? Yeah, yeah. Hmm. It seems they're currently traveling away from the urban area of Gormont. Leaving the town? But there's nothing out that way. Perhaps they're on their way out of Gormont itself. Oh, and... What? It seems a certain shipment has set out. The core crystals heading to Indol for cleansing, huh? How pious of them. Shall we handle them? I can deal with that myself. You concentrate on the Aegis. Understood. Well... I am looking forward to clapping eyes on the Aegis. By the way, what of Nia? You know where she is? Yes. Look, this dot here. Without a doubt, this is Dromark's wavelength. It seems they're traveling together with the Aegis. With the Aegis? Huh. Do as you see fit. Understood. You don't need to ask me twice. Right then. We're gonna take the Monoceros. Hmm. As you wish. Hey. Don't do anything too reckless. What is that? A Cloud Sea Compass. A must-have for salvagers. It's sort of a map of the Cloud Sea. If you do this, and this... What's the date today? Um... A math October 5th, 4058. Okay. So now we put the date in. See? Oh, this is very clever. Looks like Gormot is the closest country to the World Tree right now. All we need is a ship. The army has every ship in town in its grip. <sighs> We're kind of stuck. Seems that way. Sorry, I'm no use now. I know, I know. But I'm all out of ideas. Rex Rex needs ship? <gasps> Tora, I have good idea! You do? There is shipbuilder living at Gormok Titan's Bum Bum. Old friend of Tora's Grampypon, he called Umon. Maybe he help if we tell him what's what. Sure, it's worth a shot. Let's get going. Bum bum. <laughs> so well, that seems awfully convenient. We can just, you know, build a ship, go to the World Tree, get to Elysium, and, uh, you know, end the game. Yeah, you know... The game came out in 2017. It makes sense why it would be short. I hope nobody actually believes that. That this game's that short. <laughs> I mean, what? Huh? Huh? What? Loading? Huh? The tutorial? Uh, oh, long rest of the Oh. Oh, yeah, because sometimes, you know, the clouds are too tall. And there's a traveler's resting tree, and you got, you got sleep. Make cloud go bye bye. It's like you sleep, and yep, words. I don't know what I'm doing. Okay, we should go this way. We got like a whole new area to explore technically because if I go in the map, that's what I hit. Why I think in divinitive. 
Uh, yeah, new area, kind of. We're still in, like, you know, this area, technically, but, like, a new part of it we never got to. Can you actually? I don't know if you can get up here uh, before all that. Also, a funny thing to mention, remember that uh, when I first was exploring Gormont, I found that huge, like, water tower? And, uh, yeah, that was the water tower in that cutscene that they used to, you know, beat Morag. Which is really cool that you could find that that early. It's not there anymore, obviously, because, you know, we kind of use it to beat them. And probably wouldn't be smart to go back and look, because, uh, you know, more I could just be chilling there, trying to repair the thing. It's like, oh, there they are, let's go kick them. Let's go kick them. Let's, kick them. let's go kick their ass! Anyway, we're kicking this guy's ass. Tumbly, tumbly, topple! If only we could, uh, launch. Even though I probably can, because I probably have a great axe with them. Uh, on Rex. But speaking of... Uh, Blades, I think... It might be time to try to get me a second one. Because, you know, Drill Mark's cool. And, yeah, that's it. <laughs> Even though Drill Mark, to be honest... Sadly, isn't the greatest. But, I mean, that's the cool thing about Xenoblade 2. Even if they're, they're, like, the worst blade, which Drill Mark is not. Uh, you can still use them. And, like... Yeah, you don't need to have the best way in the game. Obviously, we know we technically, you know, do because Kyra. There we go. Jeez. Fight's like finally over. That took so long. Basically, the entire just that day. Whoa, that's amazing. Use your level two. Oh, we have like not used your level two at all. I've just been using your level one and three because for volcano and mega eruption. So yeah, that fight, that took like a long time. I'm just surprised we even made out alive. This is still, okay, oh my God. Are we gonna do the same thing again? This is still technically early game. And you know, this is like the time when you get one shot. When you're not OP, when you don't have all your skills, all your blade charts filled out to the max, all your arts at max level. So like, this is the time for you to get just bodied. And I guess, to learn. Because, I mean, later on, you're, you'll, you'll probably still get bodied. But like, this is the chance to learn. Which, you know, apparently, I hear people who played this game didn't learn how to play the game. <laughs> they didn't have... They didn't have their Nell guides to teach them how to play the game. Which, I mean... I mean, if you... If you I'm not the one you should be... If you're struggling with Xenoblade 2 combat and you're watching this, go watch Nell videos. Nell knows what he's doing. I don't. I know... No, no, like, literally did videos on every single blade in this game. So, like... Give him love, even though I guarantee literally anyone who watches my channel knows him now. I act like no one's ever heard of him. That they watch if people watch my videos. Which in reality, if you've heard of if you watch mine, you know of him. I guarantee you probably know of like every Xenoblade person that makes that's content blade chronicles. Okay, that fight wasn't as long. Is there any more monkeys? Any more any more people that want to fight me, even though wait, am I even going the right way? No, I'm not even. Not even not even close. I'm just exploring. Cause that's what I do. Look at the world. Yeah, like this is the wrong way. Look at all that. Look at you were just like down there. Oh hi. Let's go. Rex, I'm with you! <laughs> okay, I probably should go back to the way tree because this is not Actually, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, wait, wait a minute. Up here.
That was weird. Pro controller, Pro controller just had like a little stroke right there. It just like I was holding all the way up and it just wasn't going up really at all. I don't know why. I've had like the worst luck when it comes to Pro controllers. Like I know they're good. Like oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Uh uh. So, uh, also, uh, the level 81 monkey, uh, there's also another returning gimmick, or re unique monster, uh, yeah, that was him. Instead of level 81, he, they're level 90, so, uh, yeah. Huh. That, yeah. Uh, as of what I was saying, though, uh, yeah, bad luck with pro controllers, I don't know why. I might try to get the Xenoblade 2 themed one, because, well, I mean, Xenoblade 2 favorite game, and just why not? But the problem with that is, uh, they don't make, like, they just don't, like, I can't go to, like, oh, go to your local Walmart, and just, like, buy one. Actually, maybe I could, I don't know, maybe they somehow magically have some. I'll have to look. I mean, I kind of looked, and I saw one for, like, a hundred dollars on eBay, and, uh, I don't know if I trust eBay on that one. If it's like a hundred, forty dollars more, which I, I know scalping, then it's, you know, kind of a rare item. So I might have to pay a hundred dollars for it, but, I don't know, I just don't trust eBay. eBay just seems kind of sketch to me. Mia, thank you for fighting to keep Rex safe. I, I'm not doing it for him. Aww, Mia. I just, wait, I just left all the money up there, whoops. Give me my money. Money, no! Yay. Core Crystal 2. Let's go around. We don't need to fight them. They can, they can live their life in peace. Oh, fuck. Well, uh... At least, uh, there's water here, and I guess a, uh, landmark. Even though all the enemies down here are, yeah, level 40. So, if we fight any of them, we will literally die. I can't wait for this just to be Gormont video part 2. Which, technically it is. This is, like, just a second area of Gormont. But, like, I just keep being, st uh, stupid and, like, dying to the same thing. Which, I mean, I kinda am. I'm just kinda, but instead of me dying, I'm just kinda walking off the face of the world because I just don't know what I'm doing anyway here's the area I was talking about it was literally just to the right and I'm just dummy and just kept thinking where uh, the immovable Gonzalez was, was the location but it's not which also hold on let me check do we have with our our good buddy old power Rex Oh, we do have some water blades. Okay, so I want to actually wait. Let me check. Let me check it's something with uh, drill mark. Even though it's yeah, pyro <laughs> drill mark. What is water mastery at for you? Oh, I can't even get to the second level. Oh, well, I haven't done any of this ancient wisdom. I am so sorry. Uh, I could technically. I probably. <laughs> there are so many things I need to do. I, I know earlier I said I want to get Nia a blade, which, you know what, we are here at a landmark, so if I need to leave, I can just come back here. But I think it is time for us to do go back to the expansion pass and grab something real quick. Right here, a firecracker of a gal. Receive... Hurry Scurry's delivery. Hurry Scurry. That's Hurry Scurry Galaxy. That's the first thought I have. Uh, Mario Galaxy. An Argentum, uh, room. Argentum room. The Argentum room. So let's go do that. Oh, since we're here in Argentum, which, you know, it feels good to be, like, kind of back. Kind of back home. I'm going to buy a Roly Poly Mirage, which... Haha, ha, that's a funny reference if you get it. It's a reference to a certain art from the first game. Which, it's funny that that 
item is a favorite of a certain someone related to the Navon character that we have in the party at the moment in time. So, also, shall we? I guess, we're back in Argentum. You could have done this, uh, I think, as early as you got the Gormak, but like, we can actually go up here, which, I mean, cool, there's a new area. Cool, there's more, the more, more of the map. Ooh, treasure chest. Wait a minute, I'm distracted treasure easily. Leave Napan to Poppy. Calm your mind. Well, never mind. We can't open it. This is a sad day. But this is not the main thing I want to come up here. Over here is the main thing I want to come up here for. I mean, there's a lot of things that came up here. We're supposed to go get the thing from Hurry Story hey, Galaxy. But, you know, this. Congratulations. Flight deck. Uh, there's really nothing up here. There's well, stuff up here. There's I... this collection point, which... Uh, this collection point is going to be, like, best friend, basically, later on. For something. And that's all I'm going to give you. Okay, but for the actual main reason why we came here, hurry, scurry, galaxy. There he is. He's right here. Cool. He's saying words. He has, a, he has like, something to give us. A free thing that technically isn't free. It's, like... How much expansion? Like $30? 30 dollars 30, 30 monies? But anyway, since uh, Nia's been in the party for a long time, she can finally awaken the blade. And sure, we can, you know, give her a common core to get something, which, you know what, we'll, we'll do it for funny. Because if we do get something out of it, that would be pretty funny. And then we, that other core crystal that we got, we'll have to wait, wait for a second, but... Yeah, but let's see. Let's see if Nia gets anything cool. She actually gets the rarest blade in the game, Donkey Kong. Okay, thank God. <laughs> I did it as a joke, but I kind of didn't want that to happen, but okay. It's fine, Nia can have a common blade as a friend, which- Oh, it's- Dude, we're getting so many dark blades, like, oh my gosh. What do you- Do you have anything- Oh, and Critical, that's so cool. Well, anyway, you're not important. You're not the reason. This is the reason. Which I'm very happy to finally have this. Because, uh, let's just say there will apps This blade that we're about to awaken is one of my all-time favorites. Which is fitting that she's a healer, because Nikki has been out our healer, but that's not important right now. Crosshead's awesome! Easily? Probably... Yes. Maybe. Favorite non-story blade. Maybe. There's a lot of there's a lot of contenders for that role, but like, whatever. She's the earliest one that we can get. I mean technically. We could have gotten the ones that we awaken on Rex, but, you know, she's guaranteed. Like, every time I play this game, it's guaranteed that I'm going to get her. Because, like, there's others that are in the pool that are, you know, technically, uh... Well, not technically. They are rare blades. Yeah, random common blade number 37 is my absolute favorite. But, like, you know, she's guaranteed. And there's another one that I'm going to, you know, we're going to save that one for a later time. That's also guaranteed, but, you know, that's not important. Cross that. Cross that. She's here. She's here. Best part. But pardon me, no. Yes, mate. Yep, yep, mm hmm. Words. So, you know, you know how we were like told to like get out of Gormont and like, yeah, we probably shouldn't be here because, you know, 
more miraculous could come around this corner and say, Hi guys, uh, you're dead now. So, you probably shouldn't be here, but uh, it's fine. It's okay. We won't, like, die. We'll be fine. Oh, right there. Right, literally right in front of me. We need to talk to you, or we don't even have to. We'll just, you know, warp into a dialogue cutscene, which, y words. Yep, those are some nice words that uh, I'm not reading. I'm just kind of mashing A. I, I mean, I could just hit start. I, uh, no, I'm not going to do that. I just, maybe, maybe there might be a line that's funny that I want to point out that I remember. This, this playthrough is really just scuffed. It's basically actually just me playing the game with this recording thing turned on. I mean, but that's every kind of Let's Play in general, but whatever. Anyway, uh, Crosset, if, uh, obviously hasn't really told, uh, Ardent Cooking. And also, uh, if we get into a fight with her, which, you know, we will, you will notice that, uh, Crosset is like me, and she's a big Pyra fan. Which, yeah. Who isn't a fan of Pyra? Because, like, she's cool and epic. Pyra will have to notice me now. There you go. There's my proof that she's a big Pyra fan. Uh, we're still not going to leave Gormont just yet, because I think there's a quest that opened up. Maybe? Question mark? That I want to do. That gives... Uh, so? uh, related to so? cooking, because Ardent Cooking also gives cooking re as a reward. You learn how to cook, even though Pyro technically already knows how to cook. Oh wait, this over here. If we talk to you, I think this will activate kind of like a, not really a side quest, but just a little side thing that you can do. Uh, yeah, level one, the infant Arden. And uh, whatever you do, do not kill it. Oh my god. I was about that. that was, I was gonna, my, I feel so awful. I was about to kill that thing. I wasn't trying to, I was trying to talk to you. Probably should, yeah. But if we feed it food, uh, no, I need, I need like all of these actually. Uh, sure, you can have, you can have an orange. Uh, there, you can have all you have, I don't, whatever. But if you feed it enough, it will level up. And it takes a while to do, but eventually you can get the thing all the way up to level 99 and it will become a unique monster that you can fight. Right now, if uh, you kill the thing, it will not respawn, so whatever you do, do not kill it. Because also later on, besides being a unique monster at level 99, uh, it will be good for, like, grinding. If you need to do that for stuff. Anyway, this is the quest I was talking about that I wanted to do. Grow little vegetables. Yes, let me do this. Please tell me I have the- I do have the resources. Uh, which one do I have the most of? Of you, perfect. Deer wood. What else do I have a lot of? Oh, I have this. I'm gonna save the deer wood, because I think you need it for another, like, side quest. Oh, wait a minute. I'm... so blind. I thought that... I'm kind of far from TV, and I thought that it said 8. <laughs> Whoops. Here, have some clarity moss. Have more. Have a leaf. Okay, uh, now we just have to think. Actually, I could just... Oh no, I did set it. I'm thinking it's definitive where you can't set the quest, really, but it's like a lot easier to access all the quests. <laughs> My brain is scattered all over the place. It is so scattered. I'm curious. How... how oh, well, I can only go two levels. Uh... Sadly, I really wish we could level ourselves down in this. That wasn't a feature that they added until Definitive Edition that you can level yourself down in a new playthrough. But uh, if you beat the game, if you beat this game, Xeno, I mean, sorry, I don't think it's really a spoiler. But if you beat the game, you unlock the feature to level yourself down. Which is, I wish, wish that was a base game feature that you have at the start. But I mean, at least it's an option. Engage 
package the size of puppy. <laughs> <laughs> oh yes, yeah, okay. Good thing that line happened. I do not understand why Tora likes tasty sausages when it's not even his favorite pouch item. You would think him talking like, cause he has like, he talks about tasty sausages and you're like, oh, he dreamed about them. You would think, oh, that's his favorite pouch item. No, it is not. It is nowhere. It is not, it's not, it's not. That's all it is. It's just not, which I don't understand. Maybe it was a translation error. And maybe in the Japanese version, it, whatever he says is his favorite pouch item, but like uh, in this release, the, the US release, it's not. I don't know. That'd be fun to find out, maybe. I mean, I could just do research. I could probably just, after this session, look it up. But I probably won't. I'll probably forget. And then when I'm editing the video, I'll, I'll somehow still forget, because I have uh, what they like to call pea brain. Fizz juice. These pouch items are really are coming into use because we're not fighting. Uh, talk, 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 talk. Now, nah, this is what we have to do. We have to. What have we here? Oh wait, this this is also cool. Cross is actually gonna make this a lot easier. I forgot she had that field skill. Uh, it's gonna make us getting these like uh, question points more, like more of the item because uh, I wanna max out, cause Pyra has a skill called, I mean, Pyra's cooking that obviously we've seen. Oh God, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. No, I didn't, I'm gaming. And we got the cutscene, okay, good. But anyway, Pyra has a skill, Pyra's cooking and to level that up, she needs to cook and it is kind of a, it, it is a process. It isn't as bad, though, because as I originally thought, because like on one of them she needs to, it says it needs, she needs to make 50 things, which you think, oh, I have to make like 50 things, and like, cooking takes up a lot of power time. It isn't that bad. Each time you level the skill up, it, uh, if I get level two, it'll count as two things when you cook. So if you make like the, the meatball, meatball, if she makes meatball, it'll count as two points on the 50. So it isn't even, you may, technically she has to make 25, so it isn't that bad. Originally, I didn't know that, and I just grinded 50, and like, I already got the skill, I'm like, wait, what? <laughs> Excuse me. So I didn't have to do that. So it is nicer on that regard. Uh, Crosshuts is technically different, where she just has to talk to certain people and she'll get recipes. And we're the anyway, hi, we're at the base again. Uh, hopefully no one... Is here to fight. Okay, never mind. There are people here. They won't notice. They're not gonna go get, like call, you know, Morag, right? Yeah, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Just uh, let me just you know uh, walk around and like get the thing. Don't mind me. Haha. -ha. Actually, we can technically. No. Oh, never mind. This technically is like kind of a new area because we never got to really explore much of it. I mean, you could have. But I feel like most people just ran straight because they wanted to get out of here. Wow, we just kind of bodied him. We do have like a five level advantage on him, but still. And we have cross set here. Cross set's like gonna destroy the world. Because, uh. Oh, we still don't have lock picking? This sucks. I mean, we still wouldn't open it because we don't have level two focus, but still. Anyway, uh, cross set's like used in the speedrun for this game. Which is, yeah, because she's, she's dummy. Crosshead, Crosshead is dummy. And yeah, if you are that curious, well, hopefully you've played the game before because they do skip all the cutscenes. Unless you're just, I don't know, you want to watch the speed run. But it's, it, yeah, Crosshead's dummy. She's, she, she gooed. It is this one, I am sure. Not sure, I know. Because, like, look, there it is. The valve. Get rid of all that poison. That is kind of messed up, just like dumping all their waste into that river. And it literally is affecting all the crops over there. It's messed up. I mean, that also happens in, you know, real life. It just, it's, you know, that's how this, the world works. We gotta dump all our sewage into the, the ocean because we don't know where to put it, but like, it, it's gonna 
in the long run, affect us more. A, like, temporary solution to the problem more. I don't know, I, I'm trying to be smart, and it's hard. Being smart is actually, it is not a right, it's a privilege. <laughs> come out, come out. I mean, at least I graduated high school. Like, imagine not graduating. Like, how- you got, that'd be a dummy. Like, imagine not. Just imagine not. Anyway, uh, hello. We're here to tell you that we got rid of the, all the poison. Now you can grow crop. You can now plant your vegetables. And we will give you, uh, more stuff. Oops, I did not mean to pet we. I'm dummy. Talk to me! Uh, what do I have a lot of? Yeah, I have, have this. 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 There you go. And now we just go sleep again. Really surprised that, you know, we slept. We spent the night at the inn. Actually, hold on. Let me check something. Let me check. So, shall we? Uh, it should be over here, I think. No, wait, no. Not wrong way. I'm going the wrong way. That is not the right direction. Over here. By Mr. Driver Man. Yeah, wanted poster. I, I wonder. I wonder who. Uh, like those are. I wonder who these people are. That is, that is a cool detail that, like, that you would expect them not to add. You would figure it would just stay like the same, like little, oh, like crappy, crap, crappy drawn Nia. But no, like they actually change it after that whole incident, which is a, just a small little thing that who knows how many people noticed their first time through. And hopefully, you know. Someone's noticed that. I there was no way I was ever gonna notice that. I was told about that. And by told, I mean I read. I act like someone came to me and was like, "Bruh, look, Rex Nia on on board." Morning, Rex. Did you sleep okay? Ugh, I slept like a baby. <laughs> oh my! I love. I just every time. Every time I, I get a post quote, whatever, just a quote like that, or anything, I'm just gonna, my heart is gonna explode. There's just so, there are so many good post battle quotes, even though it's not a battle quote, but like, just quotes like that, that no one is gonna hear, like, probably half of. I just hope, like, uh, when Xenoblade 3 happens, that they have like just good post battle quotes but i mean we all know they are going to and yeah like xenoblade one has good quotes like you know when i play that what have we here? i do same thing's gonna happen ground? again just like thinking of like some off the top of my head like there, there's so many good ones and same with this game and i'm hoping there's one Really, like, kind of rare one that I hope we get, but that we can't even- it's not even possible to get right now, but I hope we get it. Anyway, are your- your- your, your flowers, your vet vegetables, they grow in, like, this one day? Because that's how crops work. They can grow in instantly and, like, all that. Which they did. Grow little vegetables. Now they're- grow big vegetables. HP attack- ooh, wait a minute! Okay. Oh, that's right, we don't get it. Okay, so now... Oh my god, a lot of things are happening. I talked about earlier that we would get a kind of cooking-related thing, but that's not through them. After you complete that quest, they won't give it to you. You have to talk to uh, Information Man, and I think he sells you it? Unless you have to wait a little bit. You might have to wait till uh, you can press pro progress more story. Which, I don't think you have to. I think you can get it just instantly now. Let's find out. Bye. And, oh, there it is. Gourmand recipe. There it is. 
Oh, so all this stuff is useless. Just don't even bother buying it. It's basically if you want to get the tutorials again, which I mean they are pretty cheap, but it's not really important. If you need like guy, just go watch like someone. Go watch a, like a Nell or Chugga. They know they can explain all of that a hundred trillion times better than I ever could. Anyway, what recipe is this? Isn't it? Uh, I want to see because it might be the one I'm thinking of, which it is. Then I can easily like grind that off, off to go. get up to everything. Oh look, yeah, Cross is cooking is here now. I just thought of a great menu idea. Look forward to that later. Is it the one? Oh no, pan fried tartari. Oh no, this is different. Uh, we can't even make it because I don't have everything. Uh, okay. Uh, I will make this eventually, but it's not important right now. I just want to see if it's the one I wanted. I'm not gonna grind it, the thing out. I said I would, but I'm not going to just yet. I'm gonna wait till we at least get to. Uh, like, level 3 is available on Pirate Scale Tree. I guess before I eventually forget, and, you know, before Morag comes to, you know, kick us out, I should probably make some of these. Uh... So we can do three of those. Oh geez, I have 20 of these. Uh, sure, throw in like five. And yeah, there we go. HP attack boost. Mm, fusion combo. I do want that. What do I have the most of? Uh, oh, 15. I just use some of those. Uh, sure, throw in one of those. And two of those. One of those. And. And I'm gonna make a second one. Because. Why not? Fusion combo, and yeah, that's no, that's fine. We should probably, you know, give those to people because if we're just making them, it's not gonna do anything. Critical up to the uh, uh, power can get a fusion combo. Uh, yeah, Ursula gets not Ursula. <laughs> this is Ursula cross set. I'm not gonna do cross set dirty like that. Cross set can get the HP attack boost. And we can give Drill Mark. Actually, no. It would make more sense to give you a fusion combo. Poor Drill Mark. Drill Mark doesn't get anything. We should. Okay. I guess I can make him a fusion combo and give it to him. So he can have something. That's not a no. I didn't want to buy that. Uh, what else do, what else do I have? Oh, an aggro boost? Yeah, let's give that to Drill Mark. Uh,. Auto attack. Yeah, oh wow, these are some of these are not the greatest. Helping hands, kind of okay, ish. Yeah, I guess okay. Fusion combos really is the best thing. Okay, so two of those and two of those, and that's it. We'll give Drummer that, so Drummer can have something. There we go. So we're kind of like better now. Uh, what else is there that I could do? Uh, do I wait? Do I have any cylinders? Oh, I do. Okay. Uh, fight two more. And I mean, we just did like one side quest. I think if I look at quest log, oh, we do have two. Fresh and fruity. Didn't I just like complete the condition? Yeah, deliver this. Oh, we get yeah a recipe out of it. What am I thinking? We, of course, let's do that. Yeah, uh, there you are. Is that? I think there's. We can do one more thing for the quest if memory serves me, which it it doesn't. It never has, and mm, might. Be will? No, that was. Yeah, no. Uh, I really did pick, like, technically the worst time to do these side quests. Because, like, story wise, I mean, it technically doesn't make, you know, much sense. Why would we be back here when there's literally 
wanted posters at the entrance of town. If anyone saw those, they were probably like, oh, I could, like, you know, go tell Morag about it. Or maybe they just don't care about it. Uh, give the chain of keys. Give the money. Uh, I don't think I even have... Do I have chain of keys? Yeah, I don't. So, that's a problem. <laughs> I, I guess I'll just give them money. 3,000, yeah, 3,000, that's nothing, that's fine. I didn't have the chain of keys anyway. I think, uh, if I remember correctly, they're probably in the Titan battleship. Which, we technically haven't explored everything there. There's like a third card key that I technically you, you could get. And I probably won't be going back there anytime soon. I would only go back there for like one thing if we get a certain blade because there is a certain heart to heart with a blade there and i'd like to be a good the funny one but yeah speaking of yeah blades even the uh dlc ones get their own like heart to hearts and also their own side quests which is just the coolest thing and those side quests have like actual cutscenes along with them that's just so cool that like mono put in that much effort and it's just amazing to me how Monolith, I mean, at the time of this game, they weren't Nintendo's biggest, like, you know, company underneath them. But now, this is, you know, long past then, three years later, that now they are technically. And they have, like, a lot more resources with the success of Xenoboy 2. And obviously, Nintendo cares about the franchise because literally they have, you know, Pyramithor and Smash, Shulks and Smash. And they technically only have, you know, three games, and two-thirds of it is represented in Nintendo's, you know, big fighting game. Which also is just crazy that even Shulk got in Smash in the first place, because uh, Xenoblade came out in 2010. I mean, it was a big hit, everyone liked the game, but still, that small of a franchise with one game gets in Smash, that's crazy. People have been petitioning for Geno for years, and he only has one game, technically, with, like, a few appearances. And he can't even get in the game. Only thing he gets is a me costume. Anyway, what is the recipe? Uh. Oh wait, this is another recipe for pie. Oh, I, that's right. You get two. Maybe this is the one that right recipe I was thinking. Hold on, let's go check that. Because if it is, then I. I'm grinding for. Uh, her recipe. Uh, cooking. I can do it. Like I guess a little sooner. I think it's Sunset Pie, which I know Sunset Pie is uh, someone's favorite house item, which I'm definitely going to make that. Sunset Pie, Moonbeam, Hot, Hustle, Mint Fish. Uh, yeah, this is the one I would grind. Okay. That's the one I would recommend grinding for, because you can kind of get everything right now. There's, uh, if we get a, f a few more field skills of... Then it'll be easier because there's an area that I can get to that has a, like a collection point that spawns a bunch of those things. But I think we can still technically do it without it, but it just makes it easier if you have that collection point. All right. So there's. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to do this quest, all of it. I think there's just a f one fight here that I just want to do just to, you know, get it. Just, you know, easy, easy XP as we like to do it, and it gives Crosshat time to shine, even though I'm not even playing as Crosshat, which I probably should have swapped to over to Nia to play as Crosshat. But I guess I can give info. Uh, Crosshat's Bitball, and Bitball is one of... Oh wait, no, I do have time. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. This is... Now's my chance! Now's my chance to play as Nia again! Over here. I'm with uh. you, Nia. Anyway, Bitball is just so funny, because they just basically just throw a ball at them, the enemy, and that's just so funny. Oh crap, I just now, looking at my arch, I didn't uh, get rid of one of them, because there's a break art she gets that I want. It's, it's break art good. Am I even going to get one art off? Okay, well, we got one art off, that's cool. Look at Crosset. <laughs> Look at his like little pose. Yeah, you get the heal. You know, it's pointless. 
And we can go for her level one. Go, great start. Uh, another reason why I like Frost said, I mean, well, obviously, you know, my name Starshin have, you know, like, kind of, not obsession, I guess, but like a naming scheme and, I, you know, space and stars, kind of like my whole, you know, stick and how all of Cross Set specials. Wow. It, yeah, are we already have our second skills here, but like, no, they all have star in the name and just, you know, that's just like little detail I like. Even, I think, her level four does? Go, yeah, go Miracle Star, yep. Also kind of weird how they don't have like, oops, the only way to view their level four is by doing this. Which, uh, I, well, at least they give us some info on it, but they don't give us like the stat numbers. Which, yeah, it kind of sucks. Who knows, maybe in like 10 years when they do a Xenoblade 2 Definitive Edition, they'll do that. Who, who knows? Maybe they won't. Maybe not in 10 years, maybe in one year, totally. <laughs> anyway, I should actually... Nope, wrong thing. Go to Bitball and get rid of... No, not that. Get rid of Falcon Turn, yeah. And I'll put that in the X slot because if we get X art... It'll be nice, and yeah, that's all I wanted. That's all I needed to do. Oh yeah, we should talk to him. <laughs> See if he has anything to say, even though he will. I think we have to collect, like, uh, s uh, puzzle tree wood, maybe? Is it puzzle tree wood? Uh, oh, it's confu- oh no, it's not, it's the ivy. Okay. Uh, I think I know where it is, but I'm probably not gonna do it. Oh, I already have five out of uh, seven. Uh, no, we can. I can do it later. If it happens, it happens. I, I think we should make a, some progress towards, you know, getting over to Uman. I've already done a bunch of. Oh, was that territory robber I saw right next to us? There's no way it was. I'm not gonna check because if it is, we're gonna. No, he's instantly gonna kill us. But no, anyway, we should make progress. And we're here. And we're here. We're here. Let me see. Oh, vinegar leaf. Oh, they give us vinegar leaf? Oh, that's where I got them. Oh, puzzle tree wood. Uh, puzzle tree wood, I think we're gonna need later. That's why I thought of that we needed it now, but no. It's for a later thing that we need. But not now. There's the monkey up there. I think he's, he's gonna jump down again and we're gonna have to fight him. But this time we have the foresight of that. So before he jumps down, we are gonna like ready and then we're gonna kick him in the face with a, our soccer ball. Jump down, bitch. Not you, Neo. <laughs> Is he gonna jump down? Come on, come on. Come on. Jump down. Quick! Will we have the advantage? I'll handle it. Come on. Throw a soccer ball at him. <laughs> it's just so funny. This, this is technically a weapon, you know. We have a sword, like a drill shield, you know, like like, swing rings, which is kind of like, I guess you could say knives, and then like, you know, knuckle claws, which, you know, okay. But then like, then we just have a ball. A ball as a weapon. It's just, that's just so funny. I want to go for cross at level 4, why not? That's a cool level 4. I mean, I just like everyone's level 4. They're all level 4 are so good. Go for the heal. There it is. There's the uh, voice on out. If you switch, which is so cool that the game has like so many of those. That just like certain blades have certain like quotes when they enter the field. Like if you switch to them. And depending on if the other blades are on the field, it's just so cool. I just love that. There's just so many like little things.
And it's like, there's a bunch of ones that you wouldn't expect. Those obviously, you know, with Cross Set It, that makes sense. Like, you know, with Pyra. Because, like, she's a big fan. But, like, there's, like, another one that's, like, that just, I find, like, well, that's really give one to be, like, these two. That's cool. Alright, just keep throwing our soccer ball out. And... Hopefully this is the last one. I think we got in the same fight, like, earlier. It's just now it's nighttime. Dude, wouldn't that be funny just start the episode off with the same fight and end the episode with the same fight? That'd be funny. I don't have, like, a strict, like, episode, like, planning. I only got say, like, alright, tune in next time, because I just, first off, I can't even see the time where I am. I mean, I can, I could look over, but, like, I'm not. Even though I, I kind of did, and then just looked away, like, I kind of just glanced, I didn't even see where we're at. I'm probably guessing we're out of time, which is a very good guess. But, like, I don't have a, I just kind of, in post, I just do it. Am I not gonna get a single break? I go get like one break at the start of like this huge fight, but just didn't get anyone after that, which is like it's sad. I want to break, then topple, and that's as far as we can go. Ooh, level twenty-one. Um, you know what? I think we could actually take it. I'm gonna play as Rex because I don't trust me. Uh. Couch item? Should no, we don't need it. Actually, we probably should take it. Don't get ahead of yourself. Oh, he's up there. Oh, I thought right. it, it was the one over there. Uh oh, that means that guy could come over Charge. and join the fight. Rex, let's go. I probably should not do that. Probably should not even be in here. Yeah, I'm gonna dip. Never mind. Never mind. Well, bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. We'll go. We'll go back to Nia. You can have her time. Even though it might cross that time. But whatever. I just don't trust myself on healing duty. Because <laughs> I wouldn't be paying attention to the top of the screen saying, like, Oh, I should low. I should use healing halo. I should, you know, actually keep my teammates alive. Anyway, this is the right way. So, yeah. Now we're going. Now we're making progress. There we go. Great Spine Boundary, which I think this is technically a whole, like, new, new area. Like, a whole, like, area on the map. Like, yeah, look. We're on the, we're on the left side of the Titan. 